Happy Thursday, everyone. Grab your cup of coffee, sit back, and enjoy me turning this pain and you know what? Coffee wood bowl. This piece of coffee wood has been nothing but a headache from the start. What I mean is, I had nothing but problems the minute I started putting the faceplate on. I drilled, pre drilled the holes, and I needed six of them. And I went to put the screws in and they broke. So I had to reposition the faceplate and then re-drill the holes and put new screws in. Five of them stuck, one of them broke. So I figured, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and start this turn and that's what I'm doing here, shaping it up. I figure I'll deal with those missing screws when I flip this bowl around. And let's put it this way, it was not easy. I really hope you guys stick around and enjoy this video because I think you'll see the end result of this didn't turn out half bad. And yes, I'm still sane. Do I need a stiff drink? Yes, I do. Alright guys, enjoy. On a happy note, I decided to look into the Amazon Associates. It's where you can have a storefront. And this is where I can post some things that I like to use on my channel. And that's there. All you have to do is click on that stuff if you want to buy it and purchase it. I do earn commission off the things that I sell. Not much. But through my store, I do earn a commission from the people who have that there if they offer a commission for that. Also, I am starting my own website. I'm in the process of working on getting my stuff in, on my website. And I will let you know when I'm ready to launch that. That's where you can go and purchase the things that I make, which is really exciting. And trying to figure all this stuff out on my own. I tell you what, it's been a long couple weeks. Getting these screws out was a real chore and I had to chisel a little bit and then turn a little bit, chisel some more, remove the screws, repeat until finally I got the last one out. And oh, what a relief it was because when, when I got that last one out, I just felt this weight come off my shoulder because I, you know, I, it put me behind, way behind. And, um, you know, it's, it's Wednesday and, you know, it's see it's almost three o'clock my kids will be coming home from school and by now I usually have my video done ready to go and ready to get uploaded in the evening and I'm like super super behind I have some spots here where there's bark inclusions so I am just gonna fill they're not that deep so I'm just gonna fill them with some medium thick brown star bond and hit it with some accelerator and if you're interested in Starborn, you want to save yourself 15% off of your Starborn order, all you have to do is enter the coupon code at the bottom of your screen and you can save yourself 15% off of your Starborn order. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was a tough turn and I am exhausted from it. I'm literally over this, this bowl. Um, it, it turned out lovely and you'll see that, um, but it was just a nightmare. This coffee wood was horrible to cut. Um, I had to keep sharpening my gouge. It would chip out. It was very stringy in spots and it, you know, with the screws breaking and, you know, I had to reposition that faceplate just to even get it um, to hold any screws. And that's pre-drilling the holes. And I, I've i tried many, many screws. Um, so that way, if anybody questions why I was using Tapcons in it, um, I, I used a lot of different screws when I first started wood turning. And, you know, that was told to me by um, a gentleman said to try these because you know it goes into concrete so you know of course it's going to be strong a strong um screw 
not for coffee wood. And you know, like I said, I pre-drilled the holes and they just broke off. Um, so I'm, I'm definitely going to look into different um, things to hold my faceplate on, different screws to be using. Um, if I have to try every one they have on market, I will, um, because that was just a headache. Well, anyways, I'm over that. Okay, so without further ado, I want to share this bowl with you. Here it is. It, it turned out really nice, though, with all the headaches uh, that was put into this. And there's it's filled in with Starbond. And I did that off camera before I even turned this bowl. I filled those big cracks in off camera. But I did fill those in on camera. And there's the bottom. Out of the sapwood on both sides. And I love that it's on the rim too. I think that's really cool. It has three coats of the water locks. The bottom still is wet because I just come in and I put the second coat on the bottom of that. But there it is. It turned out lovely. It's got a natural red spot in it right there, which is, I love that hues. All right, guys, let me know in the comments what you think of this bowl and this turn. I'm exhausted. I am going to go get a shower and I'm going to relax. I am beat. All right, guys, until next week, y'all take care, stay safe, God bless, goodbye.